in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the games that got me to number one in the world with Logbait. Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be trying to push to number one in the world with Logbait. If you guys enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm just going to go for my Fire Spear at the bridge here, and I'll go for my Goblin Barrel as well. I'm playing my original Mighty Miner Logbait deck with the Fire Spirit and the Skeletons. I thought it would be a good time to return to this deck now that Ladder is finally back to normal. Just gonna go for a princess in the back here. I'll go for a cannon here as well on the giant, and I'll also go for a mighty miner on the miner. All skeletons up top to pull over the giant and the phoenix. This is probably the deck you guys first um started seeing me play, I would assume. This is kind of the deck where I first started getting the number one with every single day for like a few months straight, and that's usually kind of like how I blew up on YouTube. Just gonna fire a spirit barrel here on the right side. So I'm assuming that's how you guys know me. Um I haven't played this deck in a long time, and it's still really good in my opinion, so I'm going to start using it in this video. I'll go for another princess here on the prince, just to make sure that the prince doesn't lock onto my tower. He actually already lost, I'm pretty sure. I'm going to barrel here as well. He doesn't have any elixir at all. <laughs> okay, he goes for the dark prince. I'll just go for a mighty miner at the bridge here to defend my princess, and I'll also go for a log here just to take off the dark prince shield so that my mighty miner can kill the dark prince, and yep, he gives up. <laughs> he didn't have anything for two... Two princesses, almost three princesses. Three princesses in the first minute and 30 seconds is crazy. <laughs> well, I guess since this guy gave up, I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm in the next game here against this guy. I'm just going to go for my princess in the back here. I feel like princess in the back is the safest play. Um, My favorite starting play with this deck, though, is to do fire spear at the bridge. Just because it's a guaranteed equal or positive trade i'll just skeletons here for the minions and then i'll go for fire spirit barrel here i know that he doesn't have log in hand i'll go for mighty miner on the miner he goes for hunter and snowball very nice elixir bait there i'll just go for a princess just to snipe down the hunter and i'll also go for my skeletons to cycle back to my barrel i'll go for goblin barrel here on the left he doesn't have log in cycle yet he doesn't have snowball or hunter either he goes for the goblins i'm gonna go for my mighty miner ability here just to kill the goblins and get the bomb on the tower he goes for minions on the right side he also has to log as well, which is super good for me. He has to miner on my princess. I'll go for my fire spirit here just to finish off the minions and I'll princess straight away. I'm not going to waste my elixir on skeletons here. Just because whatever he puts, I might want to counter with skeletons. If I had to guess, I mean, I'm going to skellies and then mighty miner so he can't giant skeleton. I'm pretty sure he has a giant skeleton in his deck. Goes for a hunter. I'll just go for the... Actually, I'm not even going to build it. I'm just going to barrel straight away. He has to snowball this. Okay, he's, yeah, he snowballs, nice, I get two princess shots, he's gonna minions, yep, I'll just go for my fire spirit here on his minions, then I can just go for another princess at the bridge here, and I'll have my log ready, but if he's smart, he, he's just gonna use his own log, yeah, but I always wanna have the log hovered out in case he wanted to be dumb and use his goblins, <laughs> already up over 2000 damage, that was a very nice start by me, just knowing that he had very low elixir and very bad cyclists for everything that I had, and that he kind of overspent with the Hunter plus Snowball on my Fire Spear but Barrel Push. He goes for the Balloon. I'll just go for my Skellies in the back here. And also go for my Mighty Miner so he can't Miner on my Tower. Oh, very bad Miner. Minered straight into the Mighty Miner. <laughs> nice prediction there. I'm just going to go for my Rocket here on the Balloon. I'll have another Rocket for his next Balloon, so I'm fine. I'll just go for a Miner here on the left side. Princess at the Bridge will lock on. I'm going to Princess at the Bridge and pop the ability here. Just to have that in front of my Princess. He goes for Mega Knight. Okay, I didn't know he had Mega Knight. He also logs. I'm going to Skellies here. I'll go for a cannon, and I'll go for a goblin barrel. I'll just activate my king tower here with the fire spirit. No, 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 no. No. Okay, wait. I'm gonna, I am gonna. have to rocket on defense. Okay, I'm going to rocket all of that. I can rocket everything. I'm going to rocket here, and then I'm going to log. Very nice rocket. That's going to get a hit on my tower because of the snowball. But I'm not going to lose my tower here. He has to do log and snowball to finish off my tower, so I can keep my tower alive. He goes for the log early. I'm going to skellies here just to cycle, and I'll go for mighty miner cannon on the balloon and i'll just go for my ability plus barrel i'll fire a spear here try to kill the goblins okay i'm gonna log them i need to get the goblins dead so i can get my my, my mighty miner on the tower i'm gonna go for my skellies here nice okay my mighty miner just got a ton of damage okay i just got the same damage lead that i had before i'll go for an, another barrel here and i'll rock it on top of everything very nice rocket there i'm gonna go for my princess in the middle here just to try to get some damage i'll fire a spear as well predict goblins key okay, can't goblins now Hunter comes back. A little bit unfortunate, but that's okay. One more shot. Nice. Okay. I just need two logs and a rocket to finish off the game. I'll go for my log here and skeleton just to distract the hunter. He's going to try to spam me in the middle with Mega Knight. He goes for minions too. I'll just go for my Mighty Miner and pop the ability. And BM this guy because this guy BM'd me before. 
I'll go for Rocket, I'll Fire Spirit up top, and then I'll just go for my Log to finish off the game. Very nice win there against that guy. I kind of almost choked with that late Fire Spirit. I guess I just had a little bit of brain lag. <laughs> Something Ian would do, but still a very nice win. I'm in the next game here against Stell. I'm just going to go for my Cannon here on the Mortar. I know that this guy's a Mortar Bait player, but I'm not exactly sure which version. I'll just Fire Spirit in the middle here, just in case he has like a Fireball for the Cannon or something. He still has to defend it. He had to use a whole Cannon Cart. That's really nice. And it's connected. I'm going to Princess here for the Cannon Cart. I'll cycle my Barrel as well. I'll have my Skeletons ready to push it out of Fireball range if he had the Fireball. I'll just go for my Skellies here to keep my Princess alive. Very nice Skeletons. Okay, he has, he has the Minion Horde version. I'm going to Mighty at the bridge so he can't go for a Skeleton King on it. Okay, he goes for Spear Goblins in the middle. I'll just pop my Mighty Miner ability on the Spear Goblins just to make sure he has to defend my Mighty Miner with the Skarmy. Then I'll go for my Cannon in the middle for the Skelly King. I'll go for a Princess as well on the side. He's probably going to try to Miner Minion Horde on it, so I'll just go for my Barrel on the right just to pressure him, and then I can defend his... Okay, he's going to Minion Horde on the Princess, hoping I Mighty Miner on the Cannon Cart, but I'm just going to counter the... Cannon Cart with Fire Spirit Skellies, and then I can go for my Mighty Miner ability on the Minion Horde. Just Fire Spirit Skellies here on the right, yep, and then he does do Minion Horde like I thought he would, and now I'm just going to pop the Mighty Miner ability, and he has to defend the whole Mighty Miner still. And all he has is really Spear Goblins, I'm going to do a Princess High in the middle to predict his Spear Goblins. Right now. Oh, okay, he knew I'd try to do that, so he put them over there, that was very smart by him. I guess that was well played by both of us. Mm, I guess it was more well played by him because... I thought that he'd be like, uh, he'd be simple and put it in the middle, but he thought that I'd think that and he put it on the side. So that was well played by him. Okay. I'm just going to fire his spirit here at the bridge because no matter what he does, I'll get a positive trade or some damage on the tower. Yeah, I get some nice damage on, on the tower here. I'm up 1500. He hasn't even touched my tower yet. <laughs> I'll just go for my skellies in the middle because he's going to cannon cart with this to try to, yep, to try to predict my cannon. I'll just go for my cannon down low now and almighty miner on top of it as well. Just to make sure that the mortar keeps getting tanked for. I'll barrel and then fire spirit the middle. Now whatever he does, I can just log away. Or the mighty miner is going to kill the mortar. Nice. He just a late scar me. I'll just go for my log now. Okay, he goes for minor minion horde. I'll just go for skellies and then I'll just rocket on this. I don't know why I just randomly did minor minion horde. He got a little bit of chip damage though, I guess. I'll go for my barrel here on the left. Actually, I'll princess. I want to start stacking princesses, I think. I'll barrel now and fire spirit too. Just so he has to arrows it. Nice. Always want to bait out the arrow so you can have a, a princess down so then they can't really use any of their swarmy cards and it gets kind of like weird and awkward for them. I'll just cannon here for the Skelly King and I'll go for skeletons on the cannon cart. He miners to try to pull it back. I'll just fire a spear here to make sure that it dies and I'll log to kill the spear goblins. He has a really bad cycle here. Probably defensive mortar. Actually, he'll just cannon cart, I think. Yeah. I'm going to go for a goblin barrel here on the left and I'm going to go for another princess in the middle. Forced out the arrows, which is great. Goes for Skarmy, I'll Fire Spirit here to keep the Princess alive on the right. I'll go for Skellies here just so the Cannon Cart can't kill my Princess. I'll go for Barrel. He's, he's gonna Miner on my Princess because he thinks he's smart, yep. And then I'll go for Fire Spirit here just to finish off the Minion Horde. Perfect defense, and I'm getting some chip damage on the left. As you guys noticed, I switch lanes going onto the left instead of the right because he's always cycling cards into the right side lanes, so... Okay, I'll go on the right now though since he doesn't have anything down. And I'll Princess. Oh wait, is that gonna... Wow! I killed it. At least I got some damage though. Okay, I'll cannon here for the Skeleton King. I'll go for my Log as well on the Skeleton Army. I'll also go for another Barrel. He has to Arrows here again. Perfect. Now I can just counter this with a Princess in the middle. And he can't even Minion Horde anymore because I have a Princess down. Always want to keep stacking your Princess. So I'll just rock it here and then Skellies to distract it. Okay, he goes for the Cannon Cart. I was going to say, if he tried to Minion Horde, I could just use my Mighty Miner ability. I'll just cycle a Cannon down low so he can't try to start trying to Miner Chip me out. Have to be smart about this. um, Because he can still Miner Chip me a lot. Okay, I'll just go for a high fire spirit princess here. This is my favorite way to counter the minion horde because your princess lives too and they can't do anything about it. Very nice play there. I'm going to go for my fire spirit and I'm going to log here as well. He doesn't have uh, anything really, really good for this. Wait, the fire spirit, I'm going to pop the ability. Nice. Perfect. Okay, wait, he has to defend the left. I'm going to fire spirit here on the left. Nice, he minion hoarded. I'll go for logs Kelly's on top of the cannon cart. He's going to minor on my princess. I'll try to catch it. Oh, I didn't catch it, but... Okay, he just did skelly king into a mighty miner. I'll barrel here on the left. I'll fire his spear. I think he gave up. No? Why would you say GG then? Bro, why are you playing if you said GG? Okay, whatever. I'll just skellies here and I'll go for a log plus barrel. I'll go for fire spear and princess. Fire spear is so good against minion horde. Now I can just finish off the game with a rocket here. It's at 230 HP. Very nice win there. I played that matchup really well. He only got like a thousand damage. 
Princess and Fire Spirit are super good in that match, but I just kept on abusing them very well. He couldn't really do anything against me. <laughs> Alright, I'm in the next game against this guy. I'm going to go for my Fire Spirit at the bridge. I'll go for my Skeletons and my Cannon here on the Hog Rider. Very unfortunate that I didn't have Cannon, but it's okay. I'll just go for my Mighty Miner here on top of the Mighty Miner. Looks like he's playing Hog Earthquake. Hopefully he doesn't have Mortar with that. Hog Earthquake Mortar is a really bad matchup. Unless you're Ian, you can't really win against it. I'll Princess at the bridge here. Okay, that's going to get one shot. That's not bad. I'll, I'll go for my log here on the archers just to finish them off. If he has mortar, he'll probably play it right now on the right whenever he gets about 10 elixir. I can't rocket on it because I'm already down. I'll go for my skellies here in the middle, and then I'll just go for my cannon on it. Hopefully he doesn't... Yeah, he goes for mighty miner. I'll go for my mighty miner in the middle. can't really mighty miner to block it or else I'll just be down too much. Well, I want my mighty miner to live. I'll just rock it here on the hog rider. That might get a hit. Please no. Okay, nice. That's going to get a mortar shot on my tower, but I don't think it's worth it to waste a fire spirit in the middle. I'd rather just take the shot and be down like 50 damage. This could be a lot worse, I feel like. I'll go for my fire spirit here on the goblins. Okay. What is nice, though, is skeletons aren't as good as goblins as killing things but they do give me a faster cycle so i will be able to outcycle this guy all skellies in the middle here to distract princess the bridge and now i can mighty miner okay i'm gonna have to log his mighty miner just to make sure that mine kills his I'll also fire spirit here in the middle just to block the mortar i don't want to take an extra shot that'd be very bad okay I'll, I'll let the archers go i think the archers will get more damage on the left than i already have on the right i'll go for my cannon here in the middle doesn't have enough for earthquake so i'm not really worried about it it's always really important to know when your opponent can afford to do something, so then you don't have to, like, have to prepare for it. So there, I knew he didn't have enough for Earthquake, so I didn't have to worry about doing, like, a high cannon or anything. I'll just Princess at the bridge here, get one free shot, because now he's going to distract it or kill it. Yeah. Goes for the Goblins in the middle. He Now he does Mighty Miner. I'll just go for my Barrel here. I don't want him to outcycle my cannon. I'll go for my Skeletons here. And uh, I'll do a Fire Spear at the back. I'll go for a Cannon here, and also Log on the Archers. Oh, Princess here as well. Okay. I'll go for my Mighty Miner on the Hog Rider. That's Hog's going to get one hit. Oh, he has Poison and not Earthquake. Okay. I'll take that. Poison is much easier. It does more damage, but it's uh, more expensive. And it doesn't kill Cannon that quickly. I'll Fire Spirit here in the middle. And then I'll just go for a Log here as well. I'll go for another Barrel. He's not back to his Log yet. He goes for Mighty Miner and Ice Spirit too. Okay, nice. That's a ton of damage though. I'll go for my Princess here for the Archer. I'll have my rocket ready. Damn, that really hits. Okay, I'll go for my fire spirit here, and I'll also do my high skeletons to pull in the mighty miner. I'll go for my mighty in the back, just to help have a three-card cycle. I'll go for a log here on the hog rider and the mighty miner. He can't mortar now, because I have the mighty miner kind of clogging up the lane. That's why you want to cycle your mighty miner in the same lane as their push. I'll go for my princess here, just to snipe the archers. I'll go for my skellies, ice spirit, and then I'll go for a barrel plus pre-log. Nice, I hit the goblins, perfect. Okay, two of them died, but at least I get a, I got a ton of damage. I'm up like 900. I'll go for my princess here, and I'll have my cannon ready if, in case he wants to mortar. Okay, he just poisons my princess out. I'll fire spirit at the bridge here, and I'll go for another barrel, force him to use his log. Okay, I'll go for cannon here. I'll go for skellies as well to block anything. Okay, I'll princess here to snipe the archers down. If he tries to go for a hog rider, I can just go for my mighty miner plus log to finish it. I'll go for my barrel here, and I'll also go for the pre-log. Okay, he's just going to goblins on top once the log hits. Yeah, that was smart. Okay, he's slowly catching up with poisons on my tower, but I think I should still win this. I'll cycle my skellies and my mighty miner in the back here. I could try to get a princess off at the bridge. Yeah, I'm going to princess here. I'm going to go for my barrel in the back as well. He can't log this. He has to pop the ability if he wants to kill it. Okay, I'm going to cannon here for the mortar. I'm going to go for my skellies on top of this. I'm going to go for a log, keep my mighty alive. I'm going to go for princess. I'm going to barrel again. I'm going to go for skellies and cannon. Okay, I'm going to log again. I can't risk taking any damage. I'll go for my fire spear here, block the mortar. I'll go for skellies. I'll go for another barrel. He's going to try to put goblins on these. Yo, that mighty just killed the whole mortar. Wow. Oh, princess here in the middle. Oh, also fire spirit skellies to keep my cannon alive. He's really trying to get a hog down, but he can't. Because my cannon is kind of just there blocking up the whole lane. <laughs> I'll just go for a princess here, and I'll fire spirit on top of the ice spirit, so he has to defend my princess again. He's going to pop the ability and go for a hog rider. I'll mighty here, so he can't do that. Now I'll go for my cannon just to kill his hog. I'll fire spirit so the mighty doesn't take my tower, and then I can rock it, and I win, because 
Rocket does more damage than Poison. Let's go. <laughs> this matchup is so hard and so bad for me. I'm only one game off of top one now, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next game. Hopefully getting top one. If I don't, I'm going to cry. Okay, I'm in the next game here for number one. I'm going to go for my Skellies in the middle and then Barrel. This is going to be a mirror matchup, so let's see what he does here. Probably Log. Oh, what? He's giving me the free win. Really? Wow, this guy's giving me the free win because he knows I'm about to be number one. Well, shout out to this guy, I guess. This guy's the GOAT. Um, wow. I can't, I can't believe this guy just gave me a free win for number one. Um, I guess thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And we'll see you guys in the next video. My fans are the best. Wow, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for all the support recently. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and bye.